Let's talk about Nebraska. Mm-hmm. Nebraska has won five games yep. and lost one game. And what do you expect them at the rest of the season? Uh, you know, I expect them to kind of continue their ways. I think uh, they'll have a little bit more of a challenge. Mm-hmm. Um, they lost to Rhode Island. That was their only loss, mm-hmm. which isn't that great of a basketball team. Mm-hmm. So they've had a pretty um, easy schedule up to this point. And once they hit Big Ten season, no opponent is going to be easy. Um, it's always going to be a challenge. Um But I do think they have the capability of uh, doing really well in the Big Ten. We have them as our number four ranked team in the Big Ten. Mm -hmm. Um, And I think that has a lot to to do with their head coach. Tim Miles has really turned the program around um, and helped them become a great uh, NCAA tournament competitive team. Okay. And let's talk about their uh, Nebraska's players. Okay. And we have to talk about these two players Mm -hmm. who is the to stars, really big stars yep. of, the, uh, of Nebraska. Yep. One is Taran Pettiway yep. and Siobhan Shields. They're Correct. also juniors. Yes. And they are their average, average scoring points are more than 20 points. Mm-hmm. What do you think about their playing? I think their playing is uh, phenomenal. I think they're off to a very hot start in the season. Mm-hmm. Um, they're using their experience to their advantage. Um, they're shooting the ball relatively well. Mm-hmm. Um, Teron Pettyway is averaging 21 points and uh, six rebounds, and then Siobhan Shields is averaging 20 points and seven rebounds. So they're wow. they're um, pretty big um, college players at mm-hmm. six six and six seven. Wow. So they can really uh, hit the boards as well and as well as score. Mm-hmm. Um, so I think they're they're great athletes and they uh, they're one of the best combo forward slash guards I would say in the Big Ten, um, and they're really a, a force to be reckoned with. Thank you for our analysis. Yeah.